The 716 in two minutes. Brought to you by Custom Carpet Center. Good afternoon, I'm Madison Carter here at 7 Eyewitness News. We're going to take you through the 716 in two minutes. New York is giving victims of child sex abuse more time to fight for justice. The look back window for victims to file claims has been extended to August of next year. The governor just signed the bill in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. The Child Victims Act allows victims to file a civil lawsuit against their abuser before they turn 55. Slow World Buffalo resumes today with its reimagined ride. There will be staggered start times, so no more than 50 people are grouped together at a time. You're going to need to wear a face mask, and there will be no after party this year. Tonight's ride starts at Bayville on Delaware Avenue. And we'd like to send a very happy birthday to a very special member of the Buffalo Bills family. Legendary coach Mar Marv Levy turns 95 today. The Hall of Famer led the Bills to four straight Super Bowls back in the early 90s. We're going to send things over now to meteorologist Michelle McLeod tracking your forecast. Well, we're going to see those scattered showers and thunderstorms happen afternoon, primarily in the evening and into the overnight. But those temperatures will be in the upper 70s to a few 80s in there. Overnight will continue with those scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms. Those overnight lows in the mid to upper 60s. We have one more unsettled day ahead of us with some more showers and thunderstorms on Tuesday. We'll continue with those below average temperatures. And as you go into the midweek, things will start to sunny up nicely going into the weekend having those temperatures shoot back up into the normal range. We're supposed to be in the 80s for this time of year, and that's what those temperatures will look like as you head into the weekend starting on Friday with 82, 84 on Saturday, and 86 with showers returning on Sunday. The 716 in two minutes, brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers.